So if you're someone who's running Android 8.1 or above and try to tether your phone to a Windows 10 PC running 1703 or higher version, you should see a blue screen of death with a kernel security check failure as soon as you plug in and enable USB tethering. So this video will show you how to fix that with a quick driver change. So the first things first, you need to go to your device manager. If you haven't already, plug in your Android phone, enable USB tethering and let the Windows uh, install driver and crash. That's normal. Re let the computer restart, unplug the Android phone and let it reboot and open device manager. Once you're in device manager, click on view and click on show hidden devices. Then you can go to network adapters and look for a device called Remote NDIS Internet Based Device. You should be able to right click on it and click on Update Device Driver Software. Once you do that, go to Select a Driver. Let me pick from the list, blah blah. Now, the problem I think here is that Android phones use a generic Microsoft driver, but what is happening is it is picking up a D Link NDIS based driver. So we need to change that, so you just select Microsoft and then Remote NDIS compatible device and that's it. Next time you plug in your Android phone, it shouldn't cause any trouble as you see here on the screen. And that's all. Let me know in the comments if this video helped you. So don't forget to check out other videos right up there and I'll see you guys in the next one.